guys. In this video, I am trying to attempt a meeting from the company called FVD.net and they are celebrating their 40 years today. The weather is as bad as it can be. It is pouring with rain since the very start and I have the feeling that I take the weather with me like some sort of dark cloud that's hovering over my car and I'm taking the bad weather with me. So yeah, the event is still taking place, but I think I'm totally dressed the wrong way. I mean, <laughs> I'm in shorts, I have a white t-shirt, I have a jacket, yes, but I don't have like a hat or an umbrella or whatever, so I'll see you soon. I'm taking advantage of me being stuck in traffic to talk a little about the car. So this is my first real journey with it uh, since I had the engine rebuilt. And I have to say, okay, the weather is, as I mentioned, very shitty, but I mean, I have covered 275 kilometers so far. I've still got more than half of a tank left. So there are still 35, uh, 34 kilometers to go and I think that I might be able to even get home on the same tank and that's not something I anticipated. The only issue that is with this car and I think it has to do with the one mass flywheel is that when I drive below 30 or 20 kilometers the car is like stuttering um, and that's quite annoying when you're stuck in this type of traffic but yeah if that's the only thing then I can 100% live with that so yeah traffic is lighting up or not <laughs> uh, so yeah I hope that I will reach the event soon see you then
Okay, so this was a bit overwhelming because, I mean, the event was absolutely amazing. There were cool cars and a lot of cool people. And also, I love the vibes of that event. There was like an artist that drew Porsche silhouettes in his own style. There was a DJ who was absolutely nailing it. And I also met Johannes after talking and writing each other for about one and a half years. Since I was with him, I was given a private tour through the logistics center of the company. So that was very exclusive. Unfortunately, the weather was very, very, very bad. So it rained almost the entire time and not just a little. So again, I was not prepared for this amount of rain. And so I have to thank Johannes for giving away his uh, umbrella for me. <laughs> that was pretty cool. So uh, yeah. Anyways, I'm now on my way home and on the way I remembered that in the town I'm right now, I think it's called Molsheim and this is where Bugatti is located. Yeah, so now I will head home. I will still have two hours left to drive. Luckily the weather is clearing up, so even though there are still clouds around, it has finally stopped raining. So driving a car hopefully turns out to be more fun. There are not many influencers that I would actually want to meet in real life. But having had the opportunity to meet Sam at Seen Through Glass at a meet and greet at d -Land Drive Luxembourg was definitely something to remember. I've been watching his videos for the past 8 years and he's a character I can 100% identify with. Most people say you should avoid meeting your heroes because you might be disappointed. But Sam remains such a down-to-earth person that my fears of meeting a famous public social media figure was rapidly vanished. I was the last one to have a chat with him right before he jumped back in his 360 and headed down to Monaco. It was great speaking to you, Sam. 